Hey, hey, as you may know, we are training for the Disney World Marathon Weekend, January 2020. Today is the end of week two of training, so we'll be showing you what we did this week. It's a recap <laughs> video. Thanks for joining us. Stick around. Hey, hey, here we are. It is the end of our week two training. Mm -hmm. Man, what a week. What did we do this week? All right, we did, was it a fit star? Yeah. So uh, for our first cardio day, we did, um, I still call it fit star. I, I don't remember if that's what it's called or not. It was this app that we downloaded years ago, yeah. um, just kind of body weight type exercises, mixed cardio cross training, whatever you want to call Yoga, it. Yoga, good stuff. Yeah, um, they got bought by Fitstar, uh, excuse me, Fitbit. They got bought by Fitbit a few years ago. So I don't, I don't remember what they're called, what the app is called anymore. We still call it Fitstar. Uh, so we did one of those on Monday. On Tuesday was strength day, we did leg work. Um, on Wednesday, Wednesday was a weird day. I had to do this happy hour at work. So we couldn't work out after work. So what we did, we kind of, we like, we prefer to work out together and get our stickers together. But it was just one of those days where we couldn't do it. So I went on a couple of good walks uh, throughout my work day. Um, and then I did a little bit of hula hooping at the end of the day, just to kind of round out uh, my uh, uh, activity count. Um, and then David cleaned the house. <laughs> so that was, that was a lot of work. It was a lot of work. The, uh, the, the, <laughs> the point is, you know, we talked about this before in our uh, week one training video. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to be flexible uh, because uh, life happens, mm -hmm. things, you know, you have to do things. Mm -hmm. So uh, if, if you're flexible about the way you do your training, uh, again, you won't be disappointed when you don't hit, you know, whatever goals you have. Just, just keep plodding along. Uh, we did it. You can do it. And here we are. End of the week. Today we ran. Four miles. Four miles. It was okay. Yeah, it was. It was not not quite as uh, I didn't feel quite as strong as I hoped I would, 
Um, last week, we mentioned last week was a really hard run, and we knew going into Saturday last week that we did a lot of things during the week that normally lead to having not a great run. So we went out to eat a couple more times than usual, which means we didn't have you know our nice healthy meals at home. Um, we drank too much the night before, yeah. and we stayed up too late the night before, and we got started too late because of those two things. We got started too late, so it was hot and terrible. So we thought this week might be a little better not doing those things, and it, it was better, but I yeah. still didn't feel as like you know, great it, as I was hoping, but and that's it's, okay. It's a reminder too, as the weeks progress and we get closer and closer, uh, we're gonna start running further and further. Today was a reminder for me, there are parts of your body <laughs> that uh, rub. Oh, did you get some shaking? No. Okay. Uh, there are he parts, will next time though. There, there are parts, thank you, I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> There are parts of your body, there are parts of your body that rub. So, uh, you know, like toes and, and maybe your thighs. I have a tendency when I get tired to kick my ankle. Uh, oh, and God. you know, yeah. So when, when you start training, be, be, um, be aware of those kinds of things. There are plenty of products to help with that. Uh, we have some, uh, and we'll talk about them in the future, but you know, week two, here we go. We're moving along. We're gonna give ourselves our sticker. We're gonna feel real good about where we are. And uh, this is pretty exciting. 26 weeks to go. 26 to go to? 26. To 26, oh, well done. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Remember, wherever we go, it's always an adventure with you.